here I am with Jonathan. That's me. Yeah, there he is. I might wait for the music to stop. So here we are at Malibu Wines with Jonathan and our Bonnie's joined us. She's brought some wine. Okay. Matt's going to taste the wine. He's going to tell us the flavors that he sees. And I've got the cheat sheet. I'm going to see how accurate he is. He smells it. Go for a little sip. No, me medium to moderate sip, I'd say. It says a bit of like guava. What <laughs> <laughs> he did just say guava. <laughs> it's the one thing Matt knows is in it. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. But a new wine. This is a musca. 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 Yeah, see musca. Is there any gunpowder? Yeah. Okay. So we tentatively keep, keep your eyes closed. I'm gonna say apple. Through an apple. Oh no. What about a kumquat? What? <laughs> That's very specific. And what is it? I don't even know. Maybe I don't know what a kumquat tastes like either, but I didn't know what that tasted like. Something I haven't tasted before, maybe that's why I can't identify it. Pear, <laughs> orange blossom, apricot, oh. peach. Yeah, I'm going to say you're one out of two. It all comes down to this. Oh, hoo -hoo. I think red's my drop. I can definitely taste the grapes if that gives me any light points. Um, a very whiny, sort of bitter taste. So like Taylor Swift, whiny and bitter? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say... Do we have cherries? We do have what? cherries! <laughs> no <laughs> way! <laughs> Now we don't even need this. That's the that's an expert. We are leaving the wine place. You can see some of the vineyards. It's probably where they grow the wine. I really uh, hope they've confused this ticket with that car. Yes. That would be very good. 